What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Thorns Gaming, or welcome to Red Thorns Gaming. I've got a Node War, the first in what I hope is a long line of Node Wars, here in Black Desert Mobile. Let's go! Alright, so I'm here in my guild fortress, waiting on going in. I think we have about a minute before that happens. Guild War! And that's not a Guild War. So, okay, I'm so used to doing Lineage 2 Revolution that I don't... There is so many similarities, but not really when it comes to a Node War in Black Desert Mobile and a Guild War or Fortress Siege, or Castle Siege in L2R. Some of the names are going to be the same. Like, they have holy artifacts that we have to, to deal with in, in Node Wars. But you don't imprint them in a Node War. You destroy them. This is, a Node War is basically a free-for-all. It can, from what I've seen, you can have up to five guilds participate at the same time. Unfortunately, ours is a one-on-one. -on -one. We don't know whom we are fighting because it's a blind bidding process and I guess we'll know when we either go in or when we f see the first uh, opponent and we try to kill him or they try to kill us and then we'll know whom, whom we're fighting but let's see oh okay now we can enter outstanding oh look we can go auto which is fantastic not what anybody wants to see me do, but considering that this is my first one and I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. I do have my PvP skills on. It's a set of eight, obviously. I'm totally going automatic on this. Now, if you see this little red thing down here, I'm not, I'm not overweight. I have, I'm like 1% underweight. <laughs> under the, uh, the max. Okay, so we're going to take a look at this UI here. So what it tells you... Kills and deaths, battlefield information. Okay. That's the scoreboard. I wonder if I'm going to be able to see that at the end. Now, here's the map. This over here, that's the Holy Artifact, I believe. I think we're supposed to... I don't know if we're supposed to kill that or... Okay, there's ours. It's in our base. And we have two guard towers, much like the Holy Artifact defense towers in L2R. Yes, and you see how it's called Holy Artifact. Two guard towers. And what we need to do is we need to find the other... Oh, I can't go out there. Haha, <laughs> it's totally, totally stopped me from doing that. Okay, we need to find the other camp, the opponent's camp, and we need to destroy their holy artifact, and then we win. Now we have a, wait for it, two-hour time limit, from my understanding, to get this done. I was told that the longest that... It took them 45 minutes to do it. Normally they say it takes around 20. If there's five guilds, it could probably take two hours. But a one-on-one, -on -one, this is not going to take that long. But enough talking about all that. I will see you at the beginning. We'll see if there's a countdown or not. I can't wait. By the way, shout out to One Hata. One Hata, XL2R player. I don't know if One Hata still plays or not. And there is our leader, Rika Loves Hugs. The leader of Let's Hug It Out. Shocker. And Rika recently, I think within the last few weeks, quit L2R. She just got tired. She was part of Enigma. And she quit. And now she's full-timing this in some other game. Destiny 2 or some insanity like that. So shout out to Riga Loves Hugs. Shout out to my guild as a whole. I'm not seeing a countdown here, so... Here we go. Wow. There was no countdown whatsoever. So I guess we run around looking for whom we're supposed to kill. And they just said in Discord who it was. Zwiggy is my... We were all supposed to be with this person. Why am I running faster than you? Okay, that's where we need to go, I think. So somebody got turned around. Alright, I don't know who these people are. But you're gonna see me die a lot. Oh. Not before I kill somebody, though. Oh, now I'm dead. Latin Requiem. Okay, we are fighting Latin Requiem.
I'm fighting an elephant. Oh, that must be their elephant. Yep, I'm just, you know... I didn't get that kill. So now I'm I totally have no clue where I'm going, by the way. Ah. <laughs> so we just follow the vast majority of people. I didn't get that kill either. Oh, slam him on the ground. Boy, I'm getting crushed by something here. Okay, so it's left. Down the stairs. I'm, I have terrible memory. Like, seriously, a terrible memory. Wow. So this is terrible. This is totally horrible. Oh wow, they're like literally right there. Hey, I got two kills. What's up? Three kills. Oh, I, I just got hung up on something. Ah, run away! I'm getting crushed here. Four kills. I'm just having fun. That's what we're supposed to do, right? And I'm tired of dying. And unfortunately, the best our potions can do is 300, unless you manage to save some of those 500s. Oh, I'm dead again. Yep. See, if they turtle, this is going to take forever. Hopefully this isn't too loud, by the way. Boy, I take a lot of damage pretty quickly. Hopefully this isn't too loud. I apologize if it is. Oh, killed him with 688 HP left. What's up? I need to get out of here. Stole that kill. I, I I admit that. I stole that. Yeah. Somebody's invading our base. And I just took a beating. Where are you going? So they're dive bombing. That's what it looks like. And I'm just getting... I'm getting HP back. Oh, we're gonna run back over here. Where are you? I don't know. I got beat up in my own base. That was sad. 
Oh, slam on the ground. Yep. Ah. Jeez. Like, I do all the work. Gotta love it. I'm just joking. This is, uh... Oh, Lord. Somebody just took off that way. I'll take that. And I'll take that. Ugh. That's definitely my second favorite uh, move in the game for this particular uh class unfortunately the best move in the world is the one where they jumped and slammed the ground with their sword that one they took away Still, <laughs> I'll take that. I totally chased that dude. And then, you know, I need to take a step back here because I need to see what's going on. I can't tell. I can't tell if, uh, I'm just joking. Ow, see, something is hitting me. Oh, I think they're using, like, the Watcha or something. They're die bombing us. They sure are. And I'm getting killed by whatever's shooting us from over the over the fence. I don't know if that's That's why they're standing over there. Wow. Well, I'm not supposed to be in there anyway. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, we're tag teaming this dude. Like, I would love to go in their base and see. 
Oh, we'll take that kill. Oh my goodness, I just got crushed. I don't know if that's their tower or our tower. In all honesty, I don't think that's our tower. That's our tower. That's their tower. Oh, get out of here. Good grief. Oh, I'm getting hung up on stuff. And now I'm getting crushed because I can't get out of here. Oh my goodness, I walked right into that. Literally walked right into that. I don't even think I've seen their artifact yet. Now oh, I can only defend so much. Uh, we're about to win this, by the way. And I was pushing the dash, but it, he didn't dash, so I'm not really sure what you want me to do. Ah, can only, I mean, can only pound it so many times, right? Wait, what? No, I don't. When you're by yourself trying to run up to their base, there's no point. So, but we just won. So, congratulations to us. Congratulations to Zwiggy taking number one. I took lucky number 13. That's fantastic. But not bad for my first ever. And we're back in here, and that's the end of that. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video, and hit me up on Discord or Twitter. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.